it together. I hope it doesn't fall into pieces. I managed to glue a piece of map. Here, look. It's either a plan or a map. I think this is a crucial element of the story. Maybe it's a clue or to me or, or hide. There is a sketch of a castle by the water. Is that a port on the route to America? The parts you have put together are just a fraction of a map. As long as we don't get to see the rest of it, we can only guess. Where should we look for the rest? And the letters. What do you make of them? This name, Mark Tain. Who is that anyway? He's a very mysterious man, and he's everywhere. He sent those letters to Jack and the Donces from Moulin Rouge. I also got something from him. A few strange job orders. What kind of orders? He wanted me to find a living heir of one person, Sophie Soriel. Now I remember. Tain's name is in the registry of the ballet rehearsal room. On what date? The day of the Danseuse's death. That's no coincidence. Let's pay Mark Tain an unexpected visit. I don't think he'll let us in at this time of day. Why don't we study the documents a bit closer and deal with him tomorrow? If tonight or tomorrow someone else might die. We need to convince the police. Unfortunately, I don't see enough arguments to support our theory. I see you're not prepared to back me up. I'm not on good terms with the inspector leading this case, but maybe you could do something. And I was hoping you would. Me calling Inspector Petty would bury our chances. And with me, it's even worse. But we have to go there. Now let's go there on our own then, but don't expect a pat on the back for it. Too bad. We're dealing with an emergency situation here. Let's go then. No point in wasting time. Yeah, you only live once. astonished at what we found here. So am I. What do you make of it? It's a murderer's hideout. It's all laid out for us. Yeah, but now we have to analyze all this very carefully. The murderer is a perfectionist, haunted by some sort of obsession. That makes him perform the bloody ritual again and again. The dolls, they're the key. They're old, if I'm not mistaken. They're stylized that way. This must be very important to the killer. So what message is he trying to convey through them? The dolls are different every time. They're witnesses. Did you see what's in those photos? First and foremost, the victims. That part I get. He was meticulously planning the murders. Second, he photographed us as well. He was watching the murder scenes closely. Thus satisfying the need for control, being the master of the situation. Third, I have a feeling that there are photos here of people he was working on. Please photograph this. These photos point to potential victims. How should we warn them? I hate to say it, but I gave him one victim on a plate. How so? That antiquarian from Mazara in the Pyrenees. He asked me to track him down. When did you give him the info? Yesterday. So, we need to go there right away. Will you come with me? If the police catch Tay and I won't, there's no point. We need to be prepared for the worst case scenario. I think he could come in here at any minute. And we're not here legally. We need to put the police on the right track to catch him. So, we leave and carefully consider our next move. I'll finish in a little bit. Just let me look around for a few more minutes. All right, but don't take too long. 